Come, my friend. Take this tool. It will help you along your journey. This tool is known as the Axe of Ascension. And its purpose is to cut through and release any binding agreements, soul contracts, and cords that are keeping you from your highest self. To release yourself from the hold of your trapped self. But I cannot just give you this tool because you must find it for yourself. The only way to discover this tool is through the journey of your soul. Using the lantern of forgiveness, we are able to redeem our paths that show us the way back to ourselves, revealing only what we are ready to see at this present moment. The obstacles that you face creates bridges. Bridges that will take you to distant worlds and allow you to bring back your medicine and magic from deep within the forest of forgotten memories. The problem is that so many of us have lost ourselves in this physical world. And this forest is where the lost parts of us go when they no longer feel welcome in our vessel. This happens a lot when we go through something traumatic that the soul is not able to deal with in that present moment. It is time to use the lantern to venture into the forest to recover these lost fragments of ourselves and discover the acts of ascension deep within the heart of the forest. I'm going to count down from five to one. When I get to one, we will make our way into the forest. Five. See yourself standing at the edge of the forest and feel yourself ease more into your body as you become fully present for this quest. Four, see yourself picking up the lantern and feeling the heat and warmth of the light. As you pick it up, take a deep breath in. Hold that breath. And then breathe out very slowly. Three, the light not only lights up the path ahead, but begins to spark a fire within the pit of your stomach. Two, feel the fire expanding and rising as the flame from the lantern ignites something deep within you, setting your heart ablaze. fire ignites throughout your entire body as you feel the flame of your soul integrating into your body, mind, and spirit. You are now ready to begin this pilgrimage. While venturing through the forest, through the fog, you see a vision of your past self coming through a part of you that may have been away for a while or perhaps their voice was just never truly heard and they drifted slowly into the forest. It may be you as a baby, could be you as a teenager or even aspects of your adulthood. It approaches you with reluctance because it has already been hurt before.
You tell this wounded part of yourself that you are sorry for whatever pain you may have caused them or anyone else involved in the situation. And that you are here now. You are present and you are ready to be with them, to be with that version of yourself. This part of you comes back and it passes through the lantern of forgiveness. While it passes through the lantern, it releases all the energy that no longer serves you. It releases all the cords and the energetic binds that are connected to anyone else involved. This fire burns off everything that no longer serves your highest good and sends back the energy through the earth to anyone else involved returning that energy pure and recharged from the love of Mother Gaia and as it enters the lantern and into your being you feel a sense of lightness into your body and this feeling of coming home. Continuing through the forest, the fog reveals all. Memories and past versions of yourself, your distant past calling to you. So many memories and versions of yourself overlaying all at once. You call out, asking for forgiveness for whatever wrongs you may have done or allowed be done to you. Speaking from your heart, you feel the deep heart wall release, blasting open the doors for your soul fragments to walk back in. As you ask them to come back home, the ones that are ready enter through the lantern where the energy that no longer serves you is released and return to all parties involved and once again returning back through Mother Gaia so that it is returned with unconditional love and support and healing. From there, the fire within the lantern transitions and merges with the fire that was cultivated in your own body at the start of the journey. You feel it lights you up in a way that you've never felt before. Almost as if every cell in your body begins to come alive. And you feel like you have become the fire. Proceeding forward, you see a clearing in the forest, a wide open field full of tall grass and beautiful flowers that extends for what seems like miles. You look over the horizon and in the center of the field is a giant axe, the axe of ascension. You approach the axe, wondering what will happen wondering if you are ready to make that leap. To sever the contracts, cords, and consciousness seals that are ready to be released by your highest self. And reveal the way through the forest back to your core. Back to the core of who you truly are the essence of your divine being. You pick up the axe and downloads come rushing in. Electricity surges throughout your entire body, breaking through binding codes within your DNA templates. Feeling this energy surge through you nothing you've ever felt before.
like a battery being supercharged. As you hold this axe, feeling these memories, dreams, visions, and symbols processing through your body, know that you will only unlock what is ready to be unlocked at this time. Your highest self is the filter that knows what you need and where you need to go. Feeling energy circulating in and out of the body, releasing trapped codes and pulling in new ones from the old versions of yourself that have returned. As I count from one to five, feel yourself returning back to your physical body, bringing back whatever is needed from this ethereal world. Five. The downloads begin to slow down as you begin to ease back into your physical body. Four. Feel yourself becoming more present and more embodied, bringing this energy back into the physical world. Three, you begin to feel the heat from the fire inside of you as it continues to spread to every part of your being, awakening every cell in your body so that you feel more alive than ever before. Two, begin to move your hands and feet as you feel this surge of energy awakening and activating your physical body. One, open your eyes. Take a deep breath in through your nose. Hold. And release. Feel this new embodied version of yourself. Feel that fire lighting you up from the inside out, revealing the path to your highest destiny. The same fire that led you through the forest. And know that this is only a tiny ember that has sparked a revolution inside of your body and mind. Keep on climbing that mountain, my friend, because as long as you are putting one foot in front of the other, you will eventually reach the top and see how far you have come. As long as you never stop, you will find the way to your highest destiny.